What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with more Idle Heroes, and today we are continuing and doing our third round of the Broken Spaces Challenge. So, last month, I think our Warrior account took around 100 badges to clear it. Previously, our Scary account took 58 badges to fully clear all 7 stages of Broken Spaces, so... Our goal today is try to beat out that 58 badges. I think we made a few mistakes in there. I have a feeling we can get really close to just 50 badges used. So really hoping we can do that. We're starting out at 482 today. I want to see this at above 430 left by the time we're done. So not going to try to <laughs> drag this out a little too much or anything like that. So we have our four scaries in. This lineup looks good. This should only take one attempt right here. The first couple stages, always so, so easy for the scary army. And I think maybe next month when we get our reset again, we might have to try this with the Terra army just to see how much damage they can do in comparison. I think that would be fun to do. We'll have three Terras. That'll be pretty solid of a team. We'll try it. Man, just absolutely obliterating that first wave. Ooh, so good. Alright, wave two should be just as easy. I think we usually do it in about one attempt as well. As long as we don't get silenced, this is pretty much GG really, really fast. Damage starting to ramp up. Demon Hunter should probably die in like one more round. Probably the next round of actives, he is just done for right here. And then we're just left with one. Because she has the faction advantage on us, it's just gonna, it's not gonna be as fast as that demon hunter. But we are done, nine rounds, nice to see. Thank you for the resources, let's go. So this one should be, I don't remember, did we do this in one badge last time as well? I can't remember. Man, I really wish I could do this on the Petrify meme team, but sadly that will never happen like this. Eventually we'll do better, but we're not building really any good PvE heroes. But we have the ultimate PvE team here, so yeah, we can we can sacrifice that on other accounts. Right guys, we have one scary army, we don't need to build multiple. I don't want to spend another year building up a scary army. Alright, big round right here. Ooh, chunking that damage off. We'll have another Phoenix active probably in two more rounds is where they will all drop, I think. Next round actives, I think they will die. That's my guess right here. Oh, they lived by like a hair. My goodness. All right, not too bad. The last scary has Punisher. The other three have Kiss a Ghost, just for your reference. Now, I would normally show this one, but... I really don't want this to be a really, really long fight. I'm going to guess five badges. So 474 is what we're going to go down to. Let's see if that works. No, it only took us four. That's better than last month. I just don't. The, the amount of counterattacks you have to watch watching the Gru fight is so painful. But next month, when we have our three E5 Terra, I want to see what... Terra's passive damage does against Gru. It should be really interesting to see. Wondering if it'll be like a Naki, where Naki does amazing damage to Gru. This one here is going to be a lot of RNG when it comes to all these stuns and freezes. So it's probably going to take us, I think, my guess would be four to five badges on this level. But really, really going to be interesting to see. As long as our Heart Watcher doesn't get CC'd too often. I don't remember how many it took us last time, though. Oh, it's always... I, the thing I love about Monthly is this right here. All the rewards you get from Broken Spaces is so amazing. You get so much spirit, so much gold... You get monster materials, more feathers, and you get those artifact shards, which is awesome. I love those. Granted, we don't need much food, but hey, it's still great. <laughs> so it looks like we took about, I don't know, maybe 15% off 
total. Okay. Did it was that eight billion? Okay. Eight billion, not too bad. I know you guys are gonna be like, not too bad, what are you talking about? <laughs> so about twenty percent. So yeah, should let's do one more. Let's see if we can beat that eight billion. I think that was 8 billion, right? I didn't just count that wrong and it's like 800 million. There's no way that's possible. It's got to be 8 billion. So if that's 8 billion, they went down 20%, so times 5. So these guys have about 40 billion health on stage 4. Not too bad. Come on, keep stacking that damage up. Man, we keep hitting Heart Watcher and Death Sworn with those Phoenix actives. So that is really hurting our damage here. Come on, break out those CCs. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Another Phoenix buff right here. Okay, that hit all the scaries. Perfect. So we'll have some really good damage in these last two rounds. Oh, although we're not going to get another round of actives off. Oh, so close. So not the most damage, but still good. Yeah, about 8 billion again, so... Eh, we're still doing good. Let's do a smash. So this should take three more. There we go. Cleared. Yep, there we are. Alright, so we are 12 badges in for stage five. This one usually takes the most just because of the sheer amount of CC. So let's see here. We got I want to try to finish the last two in 40. Hopefully we can. It would be really convenient if we could do this within 40. But, of course, so much of this fight comes down to RNG. Ugh, it's going to be so much CC right here. Hopefully the, the scary stay alive, though. Purify, come on, let's keep purifying all that CC. Perfect on all of them and the Heart Watcher. Oh, come on, Heart Watcher. That top scary has been CC the entire fight. Come on, you got to get a heal off. There we go, perfect. Oh, come on, man. Stop CCing us. We need to get that energy. We need to get those actives. Oh, one of them went down. That's the, that's the problem on this wave is if they don't get an attack in like three to four rounds, chances are the scariest are going to die. But if they do attack, they go straight back up full health. So we did six billion, and yeah, it just all comes down to how much they're CC'd, so... 6 billion right there was about 8%. All right, that shouldn't be too bad. Let's watch a couple more. Hopefully we can do more. I feel like we can do more than 6 billion for an attack. Oh my goodness. Stop freezing me, man. Oh, and then of course they go from freezing to twine. Awesome. Come on, break out, break out. There we go. Get those heals back up. We need to not die, that's for sure. Alright, we hit three of the scaries. Not four, but let's break out that top scary. He's getting dangerously low. Yep, he didn't get a heal off in time, so he did die. We're still doing good damage, though. I will say, I am I love coming back to this account because you don't have to sit there and wait to watch Garuda's passive damage over and over and over. So, Ooh, that was a lot worse. 4.3. Alright, one more fight. Let's see how we do. We'll do this last one, then we'll smash it out, see how far we get. And I will tell you, I'll tell you what, if we had a Gustin, I'd almost sit one of our scaries and run a Gustin in this, just to cleanse all that. Although, you know... If we if we do end up building an E5 Bell Rain, that Bell Rain would be very helpful if she goes slower than the scaries or even faster. Because if she's cleansing off those CCs, that'll be really good. Oh, we are dead. Bye bye. <laughs> this is a really bad round. Oh my goodness. We didn't even hit one billion. Oh. <laughs> 
All right, well, let's do this. Let's smash for 10. So we're at 467 right now. That looks good. Smash go. Ooh, okay. So we're at 57. Let's put in seven more. Okay, so we've basically almost used all 20 attempts here. That means we have 21 to go if we want to to get that perfect right around 50-ish badges. Oof, this is gonna be tough. So we need to beat this in 19 attempts if we want. Did I do that math right? I think 19, yeah, because if we want to end at 432, that'll be 50 badges exactly. So hopefully we can get lucky here. We're dropping you out, throwing in Amon Ra. That looks good. Let's go. I don't think we can do it without an Amon Ra, honestly. The Heart Watcher would just die way too fast. Although you know what would be interesting? Subbing out Amon Ra and putting in a carry instead. Just a 5 star carry. That could be interesting. Because the, the scary should be good enough to keep themselves alive. And really, all Aspen and Ada's damage comes from their actives. And if Ada never gets an active off, we're not even taking damage by using our actives. Ooh. Should we test that out, guys? I think we should. We have a carry. Oh, I don't think I ever leveled or geared her up on this one. So maybe we'll think about that next month. I don't know. Overall, we're doing really good this round, though. Like, really good. We haven't lost yet. Oh, three horrifies is brutal. Come on. We might lose a couple scaries here. Yep. We almost made it the whole fight. It was close. Those horrifies at the end, though, just really killed us. Three billion. I'll take it. Three billion a fight without having a DA. That's good damage, I will say. That is really good. So here's the test now. Let's see, can we do it? That was about 4%, so man, that means we would need about 25 more, which puts us under where we wanted to be. So let's do this. We need 18 to see if we can hit under 50. Do you think we can do it? Oh, it's gonna be close. It's gonna be really close. Oh, we're not even close, Never mind. <laughs> All right, so our previous attempt was 58 badges. So that would mean we're at 50 now. So if we can do it in seven more, seven, if we can finish it right here, we break the record. Let's go. Okay, so we won. So let's see, we used a total of 55 badges this time. Okay, that's not too bad. That's a new record for us. We went from 58 badges down to 55. So we're doing better, that's for sure. <laughs> I mean, the big one is going to be is if we can find a better way to deal with this wave here or stage 6. Ooh. So actually, stage 7 is taking more badges for us now. Not horrible, but still great. We cleared it. 55 badges is our new record. Any of you guys out there with a scary army... Let me know how many badges it takes for you. Anybody else that has a DA, let me know how many badges it takes you to do Stage 7 and how many total. I'm really interested to see because I'm still so tempted to build an E5 DA just to clear Sealand Dark and then just get just swap him for a Amon Ra. I think that's that would be a good idea. Just complete swap out so we'll have our second Amon Ra. That way we get seal land done we can put up we can see if we can break records in seal land or broken spaces as well yeah i think overall that'll be good but yeah i'm happy to see that i didn't want to make this video too long this month i know last month we took forever doing the grew wave so hope you guys are enjoying the content this weekend expect to see a few more videos today before the weekend's out i can't wait for next week so we finally have our news videos again if you didn't check out yesterday, make sure you go see our second account tune-up video. I'm loving doing those, and it sounds like you guys are loving them too. So if you do want to support the channel, you know, just become a member as well. If you want uh, an account tune-up as well, research that. Go take a look, see what it takes. And uh, yeah, 
Look for more videos today, maybe some more Sport Hero guys, and I'll see you guys next time.